Hi guys and welcome back to another episode of A Dairy Man's Diary. As always, joined with me, Jamie. So today we are finishing our grass, our first cut, grass first cut 2019. Finishing it up it off with my great friend who's so helpful well with my great nephew who's let me borrow his forager and let me borrow his tractor and trailer so let's just get out of this go and talk to my nephew so yes we will Ask him to pull it around here. So I have them three fields at the moment, and I still got another two and a bit left, including this one. So yeah, I've got quite a bit. Right, so at the moment we are silaging as you can see and it is going very well to be honest. Come on nephew, I thought you were supposed to be a good driver. Not a terrible one who keeps switching sides. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go Come on, nephew, get your head in the game. Stop switching sides, you dumbo. We have got like a hundred odd tons in the silage pit. What the hell? I'm just gonna go and speak to my nephew and say, Can you please sort this out and stop being so stupid? Right. Why the hell have you come in this field? Why the hell have you come in this field? What's the point of it? Exactly, there's no point. Can you please drive a bit better? Because we have got stuff to do. And your driving isn't helping very much. I'd rather just do it on my own, to be honest. Let's make another spot here. Ow. So, we're going to come round here, then up. Up here, so at the moment, once I finish this cut, first cut, I am going to buy a lot more cows, and I mean a lot more cows.
These two gateways are so awkward. So three. This is a very nice drawn here. I could, I, I wish I could have it myself. But this is hopefully what I'll have in the future. And yes, I have got my eye on a brand new tractor. What I'm thinking about getting very soon. It's another John Deere. But yeah. Right, come on, nephew. I find a good talk to you. Come on. So this is a very, very, very nice forager. I wish I could have it myself. I wish I could have all of his kit myself, to be honest. Some very nice kit, but he doesn't really drive it the best. Let's go to the bottom of here. And come on here. I haven't got a lot of grass in this field at the moment, but can't really do anything about it at the moment. Down here. Pick that bit up. Then pick this up. Fast enough, you come on. Wrong side, you idiot. God, I hate my nephew, he's so stupid. But then I am very grateful for what he lets me borrow. Right. Here. Then we can go in. Well, let's go and take this. My nephew doesn't actually know where to go, and it's literally just over the other side of the road. He's that pathetic. So he just waits outside whilst I go and take the trailer. This is a very tight gateway. 
Can you imagine coming down through this road and trying to get in there? You have to like go down there and then reverse into the gateway. It's a nightmare. I had to do that like five times and that is a pretty big field and I did get quite a bit of grass out of it. So this is the first time you're going to see the pit moment. It's got quite a bit in it. But it hasn't got the most in it. I was hoping for a bit more. But what you can do is what you can do. You can't do any better, can you? Just have to improve next year. See, I only moved, I, I didn't move into this farm that long ago, and none of the fields were fertilised. So next year we should get a lot more. So I'm just going to have the drone out whilst me, and I'm going to be talking whilst doing that, because I can't, it helps me see whilst reversing, so see you in a minute. So the drone is out, it should be, and then I'm reversing into the pit, and then we're going to tip. Should be back in the cab now. Let's see what's happening here. Oh, that didn't go to plan. I'm stuck. Right. Can't just try. Come on, tractor. You know you can do it. Oh, I know you can do it, to be honest. Right, so we are going to go back over to the field, or to the field. Clipping so much stuff today. Unbelievable. No surprising thing is the trailer isn't taking any damage. Then here we are back in the field. And we start forager back up. And we'll probably do this last swath. Then I'll probably end it there. Come on, nephew. Oh, he's so slow. Surprised he even has all this kit. And then, you know, he goes into his own forager. We have got a lot of stuff to do at the moment. Got maize planting. Got slurry spreading. We've got line spreading, so we've got to line spread this field because the quality is so, so, so bad. So we are going to go into the next bit of field.
What the hell? So that'll probably be the end of the video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.